we always welcome the opportunity to have this moment of communing with you and to address those questions, those thoughts, those feelings from deep within your hearts. As you travel through the periods of time within your earthly life, for each of these periods there's something that you may refer to as a theme. For the current year that you have just entered, and for most of this period of your 12 months, the theme will be that of releasing the past. You will find from time to time that memories of this life you are in at the moment and of previous lives at times will now come to the surface and the reason for this is to give you the opportunity to look at these previous events and the feelings and the thoughts that you had at that time, the emotions that you experienced and to understand them more fully and to release those parts of this that hold you back in any way. Throughout your lives you experience various things, some consciously, some subconsciously. But all of the things that happen to you throughout your lives affect you on some level. Much of this is held in your cellular memory and this is the time in the era of your planet that the opportunity exists to go back and look more closely at these memories and how they have affected you. Through going back and looking, if you like, reappraising your life and into your past lives, it affords you the opportunity to understand events that are occurring now. When you experience feelings, particularly those that you find somewhat unpleasant at this time, it will be helpful for you to understand where these originate from. This may be from one point of reference, or it may be that over your various lives or through this lifetime that various happenings have occurred that have reinforced these feelings, attitudes emotions that you experience. Throughout this year there is a great clearing, if you will, taking place and this will affect different people in different ways. For some this will be a case of departing this planet, for others it will be more subtle changes. We advise you that it is important at this time to increase the meditations, contemplations that you carry out, to give yourself time to clear your mind, to welcome thoughts, memories that come to you, and try not to dismiss these or block them as insignificant or as painful even, but to look at the experiences that are re-emerging and to do this with an open heart and with a view to understanding them more fully. It is through this openness, through your heart, not through your mind, that you will understand the meanings and the lessons of these experiences, how they have affected you, why they have affected you in the way that they have, how you can benefit from them and how indeed you have already benefited from them and how you can release that that you no longer need. There is much in your emotions, in your cellular memories that no longer serves you. Although, on the one hand, you remember everything and will forget nothing, you can change your viewpoint of these memories through the influence of those around you, your families and the media and, and other various outlets come to judge the experience that you have, but not judge them 
always in the correct and supportive way. Within all experience, whether these may seem to you to be good or bad at the time, there is always a lesson to be learned and something within that experience that is of a positive nature. And the lesson is to let go of the apparent negative part, and the negative part is necessary for balance, as, as you do know. But to focus on what it is you're learning from this experience, however good or bad it may seem. you would probably understand that it will be the case that when you have the negative experiences you do in fact learn more from them. Because obviously they do have a bigger impact on your psyche, on your consciousness. You may find during this period of time, this linear year that you are now in, that your dreams will become more vivid, you will receive more guidance during your sleeping hours. And so make a point of mentally asking yourself before you lay down to sleep at night to remember the dreams that you have. And then these will come back to you during your waking hours. And in time, particularly if you can keep a journal of your dreams and your thoughts throughout the day, you will see a pattern emerging. We know many beings on your planet do keep a record of their experiences, but many do not. But this time of this year on this planet is an important time for you to note these things, to note these feelings, note these attitudes, note, note things that are happening around you, note things that seem like coincidences which are indeed synchronicity. Begin to notice these things and because you will not remember them it is important that you should make notes of them. And then when you look back, you could do this on a weekly basis, you will see the patterns, you will see the learning that there is there for you and how things have changed and can change for you. We are aware that for many incarnated on your planet at this time, there are great hardships and many of these beings feel lost. We are aware that you do endeavour to help these and the more compassion you can show, the more it will help to lift them from their despair and helplessness. However, we do ask you to be aware that you do not become dragged down into their emotions, into their sadness, into their depressions, into their hardships. This is a very important point. And you can help yourself at this time when you encounter these people or work with these people by making a point of taking greater care of yourselves through your drinking of water, through the ingesting of the correct foods that lift your energy and for taking time out to relax and do those things that bring you joy as well as you know your meditations. This is an important point. As time passes by, there will be much more work for you all to do, but you must ensure that you give yourself space each day for yourselves. For unless you are willing to do this, the job of helping others will become more difficult for you and draining of your energy. We are aware that the energy of some beings around you is low and Although when you are helping them, this is something that you protect yourselves against. You also need to be aware of those people you mix with on what you call a social level, that you are not mixing with those that drain your energy. Try to surround yourself with those people that you find uplifting, that make you feel what you call good within yourselves. But it will be those beings who in some way 
encroach upon your energy as though they are sucking it away from you. And this may be conscious or unconscious to them, but nonetheless it does occur and you need to be aware if this is happening to you. In saying this, you can channel through yourselves a great deal of healing energy out into the world around you. And so to return to the beginning of our discourse, we would ask you during this year to focus on those emotions that you find difficult, that you find most challenging, and go back with the help of others or maybe a therapy or two, where you can help to release this energy and understand what it is that makes this difficult for you. All human beings have problems with their emotions and this planet Earth is the planet of emotions and you are here to experience those emotions and to understand them. But this is a particularly important time in your growth when you can understand more why and how these emotions affect you. And in understanding them, you can control them in a positive way. We do not ask you to feel no emotion whatsoever. There will be times of sadness and joy when you feel much emotion. And this should be seen as a positive occurrence. But there are times when emotions tend to, if you like, get out of hand and affect your mind, affect your thinking and you begin to think illogically. And at this time you need to centre yourself to bring yourself back into your heart. Become aware of your divine self. Align yourself with this. And begin to look at your feelings and your sensations from a different viewpoint. During this year there will be much opportunity through meetings and various broadcasts, televised and radio and books that you will come across that will help you to unfold as you continue on this journey. We ask you to be aware of this.